Good morning. It is Christmas Eve morning and I just got up. I think it's like it's eight o'clock. I didn't really get to sleep in. If you guys have watched my vlogs in the past, you know that I just don't sleep in. Don't know what it's like. <laughs> I think just being on such a consistent routine for so long, just I wake up no matter what. I wanted to go ahead and start off this vlog though and welcome you back to another YouTube video. My name is Lauren if you're new. I am not spending Christmas Eve here. I'm going to my dad's house which he only lives like 20 minutes away. It's not even that far. So Christian left this past week and went to South Florida so I'm not gonna spend Christmas Eve here by myself. I'm just gonna stay at my dad's house and spend the night there. So I was up late last night editing a YouTube video and um, I actually am thinking about posting it today. I have a busy weekend and a busy next week of editing. I am editing my year in review video which I did last year and I love so much. It just is so con time consuming. I go through 12 months of footage and compile it into a video of like all the highlights from the year so it takes a long time so last night i did the fireplace on the tv with the christmas tree i think i'm gonna do that again and then look at i left my computer out here because i was uploading a video through the night but i think i'm gonna put up the little fireplace again so I think I'm going to do this, listen to some Christmas music, maybe start editing my video. I'm going to make my lemon water and sit on the couch, make coffee. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, so I just took out my vitamins and I'm about to take them with my morning lemon water. I wanted to thank Golly Nutrition for partnering with me and working with me on today's video. With the new year approaching and new year's resolutions approaching, at least for me, it is getting back onto a healthy routine, taking my vitamins, making sure I feel my best. And I always love going into the new year feeling really good. I just recently started taking these and I have been dying to try the apple cider vinegar gummies for years, but I just never took the plunge because I've been semi okay with taking apple cider vinegar this way, the gross way. And if you guys have watched my YouTube channel, you know I've been taking apple cider vinegar for years since college. So it's probably been about four or five years now that I have been drinking apple cider vinegar. So look no further for the easiest way to take apple cider vinegar. These gummies, this is what they look like. They taste like apples and that's what they basically say is taste the apple not the vinegar you guys these are so good they taste like candy they all taste like candy christian's taking them too comes with the guide to the gummies so apple cider vinegar gummies it's gut health digestion and appetite so i love that they're gluten-free vegan non-gmo and unfiltered and then the ashwagandha gummies so i'm not going to read through all of them but this is what it helps with and then the super fruit beauty gummies this is what it helps with as well with the holidays going on in the new year and new year's resolutions i don't know if you guys want to start incorporating vitamins into your routine but if you do check out golly nutrition it's a great way to start you even have this super greens gummies which i actually want to order so yeah, definitely check out Golly Nutrition. I will link them down below for you guys. Okay, I just made my lemon water, my chlorophyll water, and now I'm about to make coffee. And I feel like this is the last two days that it's acceptable to use a Christmas mug. And I don't know which one I'm gonna bring to my dad's house because I of course can't miss out on the opportunity to use one of these. But I think I'm gonna bring this one to my dad's house and use this one, I think. Let's do a latte. Just 
I always brew my milk or froth my milk before because your shot of espresso and your milk is supposed to mix together within the first 30 seconds of you brewing the espresso shot because you'll get a less bitter tasting shot supposedly. I don't know if that's a myth. I know that I read that somewhere. So I've always just <laughs> done the milk first. And especially with this machine, I feel like it takes longer than 30 seconds to froth it up. So yeah, I've shared my coffee recipe a million times. <laughs> it's not even like a recipe, but I just use the milk, oat milk, and then cinnamon swirl nut pods. There's so much noise, I'm sorry. But I'm gonna take one of these immunity super shots. You're supposed to sip it and not take it like a shot. Okay, I posted my YouTube video, it's a little bit later. And now I'm gonna watch The Polar Express. It's like one of my favorite Christmas movies. Growing up, I used to do Christmas plays in front of the whole family and we did a reenactment of the Polar Express one year. I used to force my younger sister and my niece to put on these plays with me every year for Christmas. So I just think it's funny, but I'm gonna watch this. I'm super, super excited. I love this movie. Just made my favorite breakfast, hash brown, avocado, everything but the bagel, egg, and some hot sauce. Okay, it is 114. I'm just putting together a little bag to take to my dad's. Just using this Ella yoga bag. And I'm bringing a festive green sweat set to wear tomorrow on Christmas Day. Okay, I just brought my bag out here. I'm gonna bring all of my gummies. Okay, I just got all dressed, ready, did my hair and my makeup, and I wanted to quickly show you my outfit. We don't go out to dinner anymore. We used to on Christmas Eve as a whole family go out to dinner. We used to buy a dress, get all dressed up, do the whole nine. But recently we've been spending Christmas Eve at home with our family and our big family. And we're really lucky that we all live in Orlando, all of my immediate family. Yeah, so we've been doing Christmas pretty comfy these days. So I wanted to show you my outfit. It is comfy. So it's this green corduroy button up. I showed it in my Amazon favorites and I really like it. But it is just this dark green corduroy flannel um, or button up, I guess. And then I'm wearing aloe yoga leggings that are a little bit shiny. I feel like they're a little bit nicer of a legging too. So I'm just wearing that and I'm probably just gonna wear sandals and call it a day. I'm just wearing some gold jewelry, gold watch, um, rings, and some hoops and some fun little earrings. I almost forgot I'm gonna wear this perfume that I got that I'm so freaking excited about. I might bring it. Oh my gosh, it just smells so good. I think I'm gonna bring it with me because it smells way too good. And I'm probably going to want to reapply before all the festivities begin, you know. Okay, let's do the last day of my advent calendar, the 24th day. I'm going to do something different next year because I kept forgetting that this was a thing. Oh my gosh, is it literally just, just Santa Claus fitting? 
So just was him with a bigger door because this wasn't even part of it. I guess I'm done. First advent calendar in the books. I have all of my crackers in a bag and then all of the other cheese and stuff in here. I'm gonna turn off the tree. And yeah, let's go over to my dad's house. That was fantastic. I'm drinking a Celsius, I'm drinking a sparkling kiwi guava one. I just got to my dad's house and I'm making the bed in the extra bedroom. This was my brother's room. I don't know what happened to my room, but this is actually my bed from my room. I'm gonna make the bed with some clean bed sheets. Okay, you're gonna hand them to me, Aaron? Yeah, I'll hold it. It's okay. I just don't want them to get super shaken. Because I don't I don't know how that even though they're not open, I don't know how that's gonna affect the combination. Of le champagne. Uh, you can't forget the star of the show. Yeah. I didn't vlog us so, um, oh wait, okay. it. So this is what we've got it. so far. Yeah. And we have the bag of crackers in the back. She wanted to do a cute Christmas tree. Yeah. Board wasn't big enough. Yeah, it's the okay. board is. And we, I didn't use all the cheese either, but I used all the meats. But not all the cheese is on. And here. she got pepperoni. Look up and not there. Do you look there? I look at the viewfinder, but you can't tell that I look in the viewfinder. You can tell for me. I also, <laughs> I think I have a lazy eye. No, I have a lazy eye. But I also think this eye, this eye is more closed than this eye is. I think I need to do eye exercises. Is that a thing? Yeah, where you can like shut one off. If, Cause I think this eye is stronger than this eye. And so you can like take an eye patch and like only use one eye. I don't know. Wonderful. I hope she keeps this in the video. Not sure she will. Kim Crawford, Savion Blanc. If you have never had it, get it. I don't think so. Very tasty. Lauren, you better keep this in the video because. Um, I'm going out to get my tripod. I'm doing a great job of whatever it is that I'm doing. What's that? She could, she's going to get her tripod. Oh. Now we're vlogging. Well, she's vlogging. Who is that? I know has a three-legged dog in his thing. Tripod. Tripod? That's funny. I have somebody that has a... Okay. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. I'm going to just give this back to Lauren. It's a, it's a dog or a cat. It's like this tripod. That's a perfect name for it's everybody. It's a good name. Together as a family for 
56 years. Seven tomorrow. Almost 56 years. <laughs> 24 years and 26 years. And so as a family, we've been together for a long, long time. And I love what we do every Christmas Eve. Mm -hmm. And let's continue the tradition. And Betty has been part of the tradition. And thanks for um, <clears throat> handling us, I guess. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You do pretty well. So, I'm ready. Right. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to toast my family. I'm going to toast Betty for putting up with this. Man. <laughs> yeah. 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 Thank you for sticking around. Thank you. Yeah. Perfect. Oh, yeah. Yeah. This is yeah. We're over there. Mm -hmm. Watching the Polar Express, I watched it halfway through yesterday and stopped watching. And Aaron and I are sitting down to watch it, and I'll just start it from the beginning. I just got home not too long ago. I'm drinking a Celsius over crushed ice, and it's so good. I'm watching another Christmas movie, I'm gonna watch a Christmas Carol, and I'm gonna turn on my Christmas tree because it's basically the last day. Just made a breakfast sandwich on sourdough bread with egg, cheese, avocado, everything but the bagel seasoning. So, so, so good. Okay, I have my eye patches on underneath my glasses. I put on a sweat set from White Fox Boutique. Super nice. It's a corduroy type sweat set. I have a big glass of lemon water. And I am now going to start editing my year in review video. So, wanted to get comfy, get ready, and start editing it. So, probably just going to sit here for the rest of the day. And start editing. I need my hard drive. Okay, now I'm ready. I just needed my hard drive with all of my video footage from the year. I'll be here. Okay, you guys, it is so much later in the day. It is five o'clock. And if you can't already tell, I have not moved from the couch at all. Um, I've been editing this video the whole entire time and it's been seven hours. I have been sitting here editing this video and I'm not done yet. I'm in October. <laughs> 
So I'm, I've pulled out all of the footage from January to October and put it in little clips. It's a nine minute video so far, but I still have November and December and then it will be done. So I think I have probably about two or three more hours left because then I have to look for some music to go over top of all of the minutes of footage. So I'm really excited. It's such like a feel good vlog because I'm pulling out a lot of the highlights throughout the year and compiling it into a video and it's just so special to me. So I'm excited. Christian is actually on his way home from South Florida. He should be home in the next few hours and then we'll do dinner. I still have to go to the grocery store and do some laundry. I'm not gonna meal prep this week. I think I'm just gonna bring what I brought for lunches last week, which was chicken salad, and then just do like some wraps with the chicken salad in it. So, yeah. <laughs> just wanted to update you guys because I literally have not spoken to you in a while. And an update is no update because I haven't moved. I've just been sitting here the whole entire time. But, okay, so, our friends are actually coming into town this week, Sean and Sam. They are coming in. We went to California with them a few months ago, and they're the couple that got engaged, and they're coming into town to spend New Year's with us, and I'm so, so excited. So they'll be in next weekend's vlogs. Okay, um, Christian called me. That's what's going on. It's been a nice weekend. The day is done, though, and I'm kind of bummed that it's already 5 o'clock. So I guess I'll fill you guys in later depending on what we do, what happens, stuff like that. Oh.